Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. It's late. I shouldn't be recording at all. But I came across something on YouTube um, by a girl named Snow, or I don't know what her name is. I think it's Snow because that's her YouTube handle. And it was dedicated to Cheez-Its. And uh, I felt like I really related to that. And I felt like there's not a lot of people that understand the importance of what is so good about a cheese it and I feel the pain because I don't have any cheese. All I have are oyster crackers and they aren't even name brand oyster crackers. I mean they're okay. They have a slight bit of salt taste to them but they don't have any sort of cheese flavor. And I don't know if you know this, but Cheez-Its are made with 100% real cheese. I don't need the box in front of me to know that. I just know that. Because they're Cheez-Its. Now these things, you know what oyster crackers are really for is it's more of just a filler to soup. Uh, you don't want them because of their flavor. You just know that you're having soup, chicken soup, and, or whatever soup, but soup nonetheless, it's like a water, it's like a drink, it's like the drink of meals. You want to thicken up your soup, you want to make your soup a dinner, oyster crackers. Not for the flavor, but for the substance. Now, if you're going to sit down and enjoy yourself a cracker, are you going to get oyster crackers for you? No, it's not going to cut it. I mean, they're okay, but they're not freaking Cheez-Its. So... I just want people out there, if you don't understand what's so good about Cheez-Its, then, then you should have some. And then have them right next to some oyster crackers. I'm not going to go on and on about this. It's late. So, thanks for watching.